Hi, I'm Malit Chachere and welcome to this special series of Earth from Space interviews on the European Space Agency Web TV. Thousands of people are currently debating possible political countermeasures to climate change at the COP21 summit in Paris. The UN Framework Convention on Climate Change has long recognized the need for global observations of so-called essential climate variables, which we at ESA are providing from satellite data within its climate change initiative. Some of the leading scientists on the essential climate variables have been kind enough to explain just what they're measuring within their project, why it's needed, and what it is good for. Let's go take a look. The glaciers are climate indicators. So they react on typical climate time scales, on uh, changes in the climate. And by looking at how they change, um, we can determine how climate change, independently from um, changes in temperature, for example. So we prepare glacier outlines, um, glacier elevation changes, and glacier velocities, all of which you can derive very well from spaceborne data. Um, especially through the uh, Glacier CCI project, but also by some other project. We have now, for the first time, a globally complete inventory of glaciers, uh, which means that we can say how many glaciers we have on Earth. That was not possible before, so um, we are very proud to finally have achieved this goal. These glacier outlines have to be checked manually, one by one. And we have about, let's say, 170,000. And um, so you need a very good understanding of how a glacier has to look like. And we are not yet there that in all parts of the world, the outlines that we have are of the same quality. So we need to go for a quality improvement and, um, let's say, some consistency in the interpretation. And this is something we can hopefully address in um, phase two of the CCI.